Well hello, this trike is for sale and today we're going to go for a short flight as we prepare now to depart. So come along and uh, just see how well this trike goes. It's a really nice trike, uh, I have to say that of course, but of course it is and it's well maintained. So well, here we are at Maryborough Airfield, Aerodrome, Airport, whatever you want to call it. Buckle in, I've got gloves. I've got pre-flight uh, before I start up to do. I'll just turn my light on now. I've got a flashing strobe here. We'll take the um, bungee off first so that the wing's now in my control. And we can now check, turn the key on. We'll just check all our voltages and everything are good. Reset the last counters. We've got fuel counting uh, burned, and also we've got uh, the time of duration of flight. Okay, so everything is good to go. Brakes on. I'm buckled in. I've got to do my helmet strap up. That's another thing I've got to check. We use a thing called Twimp for sure, which we'll go through in a minute. All right. So, switch is off. I'll give it a short crank so that the oil is distributed through the engine. Magneto's on. Clear prop. And here we go. Oh, choke on. Choke full and go. And it's a warm afternoon. We probably don't need that much choke. So There she goes. Apparently the oil temperature is 33 degrees and that's just from sitting in the hangar. I'll put my gloves on as the engine warms up. We'll turn the radio on. Wind is currently from the southeast, so we'll be taking off on runway 12, which is a grass runway. Check the helmet's lock. Now we use a thing called Twimp Fisher, as I said before, which stands for throttle. Um, we'll leave the choke for the moment. The wind is quite horrible. Okay, throttle. Wings, wind and wires. So we're looking at the wind. I've already said runway 12 is the preferred at the moment. Wires of the wing not twisted. Everything's good to go. Everything looks good. Mixtures. We're, um, we can probably shut the choke off at the moment because it's 35 degrees and 36 degrees. Um, mixtures, pins. We check all the pins around the uh, airframe. So we've got these ones here on each side. We've got our training bar pins and we've got the hang bolt pins, safety pins up there. Everything's good there. We've also got to check our trim. I normally leave it at maximum speed. It's a Streak 3B wing. Okay, and then we've got mixtures, pins and fuel. Now I've put in uh, 42 litres we've got to burn. The time is now 4.11 p.m. So that gives us approximately um, burning 10 litres an hour, four hours of flying time without a reserve, so we should only fly for about three and a half hours at the most. That gives us till after sunset, which is 6.45 today. Okay, so mixtures, pins, fuel, instruments. Now we want to set our Q&H, and we just normally set the airfield elevation here, okay, which is about 40 feet, uh, meters, correction, above sea level, and We've got the um, instruments and security in the house. Okay, so we've got helmets and security. Nothing loose in the cockpit. Passenger belts done up. Security. Um, switches. We'll do that shortly. And helmet is done up. And radio is on the right frequency. It is now, and check for traffic and make our call. So let's go and have a good flight. 
Maribel Traffic, Michael Light 6257 is taxiing for the holding point runway, uh, oh, taxiing grass for runway 12, Maribel Traffic. Currently temperature is 43 degrees so we'll be ready to roll as soon as we get there. Traffic Maribel, Charlie Tango 4466 is Eight decimal five miles to the south inbound. Currently 4,500 feet on descent. ETA to circuit one three. Traffic Maribara. Maribara traffic. Michael 6257 enters back tracks runway one two. Maribara. Check for traffic. Ooh, we're going through the long grass. They need to mow it more frequently. Okay, so we've got long grass, but we've got a headwind, so our takeoff roll should be pretty much normal. Gr dr the grass is dry. Okay, we're just going to pull over here and we're going to do the engine run up just before we um, line up. And here we go, we'll hold it at about three and a half thousand RPM. And one side. Very good. Temperatures are good, pressures are good. Let's roll. Maribel traffic, Microlite 6257 lines up rolls 1012 for a local flight. Maribel traffic. Traffic Maribel and Microlite. Uh, Tally Tango 4466 is 4.5 decimal miles to the south inbound, currently 2,500 feet. Um, expected to join crosswind for runway 1-2 in approximately three minutes. That's traffic Maribyrne and Microlite. Check for um, freedom of movement in the wing and we're good to go. Good, and we're off the ground. Okay, bit of rotor off the trees as usual. Currently climbing at 1300 feet per minute, like a rocket ship. Traffic, Microlite 6257 is Air 1 runway 12. Uh, climbing through 600 for 1000 for a local flight departing the circuit to the east. Maribel traffic. She's a bit crossed up. Okay. 1500 looking at traffic. Now, he's in uh, circuit now, so he's good to land. And um, 
Yeah, so what was I saying? So we're talking about roll. So if I respond to the wing, if I let it go, I'll probably have a smoother flight, believe it or not. See, that's no hands. Uh, just just got to keep some hand on it. I'm not quite 100% sure. I've got to keep the direction that I want to head. So if I don't over yank, over correct the bar, then yeah, the wing will roll around, the trike base won't be rolled around quite so much and I'll have a more comfortable ride and I won't be as tired when I finish flying. So the wind will, the wind, the wind, the wing will continue to automatically right itself due to the weight. Maribara Charlie Tango 446 turning final runway 1-2 full stop. Maribara 